Hey everybody, King Tom here. Welcome to a Wizard 101 tutorial video. In the spirit of Double Pet XP, I'm going to show you what talent tokens are, how to get them, and how to use them. How do you get these talent tokens? You get them by just training your pet from baby to ultra. You can also get them as rewards in the pet promenade event as well. I will train some pets in this video and show you the talent tokens that I get in this video. Without further ado, let's get to training. Let's do this. I have a couple of pets to train. I have bought some pets in the in the pet shop. I got some points. So let's do this. Talent stealer. Okay. We don't have any talent tokens yet, but that'll come soon. Let's keep training. Do, is there a certain snack that you like? Yellow corn? Yellow corn. Okay, I'll feed you some yellow corn. Talent spoon. See? Nothing yet. We're not getting them yet. Just bear with me on this. I you mix uh, a mixture of snacks. Mostly, I think you just like yellow corn, so I'm just gonna feed you yellow corn. Uh, I got these snacks from Double Gardening Event that I finally decided to do. So yeah. Okay, and... You see? Oh, I got Fairy Friend. Okay. I already have a talent token. This is only one. But you'll keep getting them as soon as you keep training your pet. So we're gonna continue. I'll also buy energy elixirs if possible. I have crowns. I bought crowns yesterday for my birthday because I was doing the Wisteria Spellmental Pack. So there's that. What other snacks do I have? Yeah, I have all these other snacks that I got from my Deadly Health and Deers and my Ultra Trumpet Vine farm. I, I got in the Ultra Trumpet Vines from the uh, Trumpet Vine. You can see that gardening video in the iCard right here. So go check that out. And also check out my gardening series. We're already, in two, already two episodes in. And I'll work on a new gardening video soon. I don't even know what plan I'm going to use actually. Alright, we are almost done. And, what do I get? Self proof? Okay, what's this? We got talent token and a harmonious token. I think that's how you say it. Now, there's a talent token that you'll get at Mega and Ultra. I'll showcase it to you. Oh, sorry, my phone just went off. I'm sorry if you heard that. Hold on. Silly. Okay, sorry about that. I, I hate it when it happens. I'm sorry if you guys heard that. I'm sorry. Anyways. Is there anything else you like? Besides this? No. No. I already tried this, but I'll feed you anyways. Green tomato. Yellow corn. I know you like yellow corn. Maybe carrot? Nope. We're running out of yellow corn. Yellow corn. I really wish I had fancy yogurt right now. I think that would help a lot. I guess I'll cut some of these parts out, actually. So I'll see you guys at the end of this. Okay, we are almost done. We gotta feed you one more snack and... Saldify. Is that a, did I fail? Okay. You'll start to get a talent token, another harmonious token, and a balance token. Now let's say you want to train this pet again to Ultra, which I'm going to do. So I'll be right back when it's uh, when it's uh, almost done to be Ultra. So I'll cut, you, I'll cut away. Okay, uh, we are back. Now, we are ready to train it up to Ultra, and there we go. We also get a jewel. I got a brilliant jewel. That's not what I was looking for. Talent token, harmonious token, spirit token, and a balance token. So, that's how you get some tokens, but let me showcase how to get different types of tokens. Let's say you want to train, let's see if I can find it, a fire cat. In this case, you'll get different tokens. So, let's train this pet. I'll cut away when we get to, I think, Ancient. Yeah, I'll cut away when we get to Ancient. Okay, apparently my fire cat likes green tomato, so let's feed you a green tomato and... Mana gift, okay. We have a talent token. Okay, I'll cut away when we get to, uh... Um, Epic, so yeah, I'll cut away. Alright, let's train you one more time with a crab apple and... 
We got this ability. It, it gives me a talent token and an elemental token. So it seems that elemental tokens will drop when you train a fire, a storm, or an ice pet. And I guess the harmonious token is when you train a balance pet. I could be wrong. Alright, let's train you one more time to uh, Mega, so I will be right back. Okay, we are back, and now we're going to train you up to Mega. And now we got Hardy, I don't want that. Talent token, elemental token, and storm token, apparently. But that's okay. I guess it'll, you won't always get it when you train pets, but we're going to try again. We're going to see if we can get a fire token out of this fire cat, so I will be right back. Alright, let's see if we get a fire token this time. Got an early bird jewel. Talent token, elemental token, harmonious token, fire token, there we go. And a nice token, look at that. And I got, uh, okay, I got that, which I don't need. Now, I think I have a theory on why I don't get, or I didn't get, the fire token the first time. Maybe it has something to do with the pet degree, but I could be wrong. I think maybe I'll train one more pet, just to, like, give you an idea. Maybe I'll train the, the blood bat. Let's see where you are. There you are. I was going to train the baby ant, but I think I'll train the blood bat instead, so I'll be back when we get to Ancient. Okay, let's do you one more time, and now we got a talent token. A talent token. Also, one more thing. If you're wondering why I'm multi simming the maze game, I'm still trying to figure that out, honestly, so... Anyway, I'm cutting away. Okay, we're going to train you one more time, and... I got a talent token and an armor nervous token. I guess we didn't get a spirit token at the time. Oh well. Alright, one more time. I think I'll be able to train you to Mega and that'll be it. And then I'll explain what talent tokens, or how to use talent tokens. I'll explain that. I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, we are ready to upgrade you to Mega, so let's get you to Mega. Now we have talent token, spirit token, and myth token. I guess I got lucky this time. I, th I, get I think I'm not going to be able to train you to Ultra because I'm actually out of snacks and I need to get more snacks. So that's how you get talent tokens. Let's say you want to use these talent tokens for a pet talent that you can get. Let me switch over to my life wizard who has one of these talent tokens to unlock. And I will showcase you how to unlock it. I will be over there in a little bit. Okay, here we are on my life wizard. Now, this satyr, Scruffy Lorenzo, has a pet talent that you can unlock. So, let me show you how to unlock it. First, you have to get the talent. And then, you see this lock right here? You click it. And this is what the talent tokens are used for. You use them for talents like Earthwalker Trained, Vampire Trained, and etc. So, you want to unlock this. You need a couple of talent tokens. So, if you want to unlock it, press the unlock right here. There you go. Now you have Earthwalker Trained. Now... This costs happiness, so the only way that you can feed happiness to your pet is by feeding it a snack. So, you go right here, pet, you feed, offer snack to happiness, or for happiness, and you feed it a snack. Let's say I want to feed you, I'll feed you some random snacks. Let's feed you one, two, three, four, five. Happiness. It costs happiness to use these pet talents. So, make sure you have snacks if you want to be able to use it. Also, one more thing. This bar will increase the more older the pet is. So if I am right now to Mega, it'll let even more capacity to use. All right, let me go over to my Fire Wizard again to showcase something that's really important. Okay, here I am back on my Fire Wizard. Now this pet right here, Peanut, I showcased in a video called the Elemental Retriever Pet Talent Showcase video. Now I wouldn't recommend getting this talent. This talent it doesn't work. It will not work. They need to fix this. It sucks. Now, it takes a while to get this talent to unlock. First of all, you need to have access to the Doomsday Croc Gauntlet, and you need to farm Crocotopia or the Time Butterfly in order to get this pet talent. And there's another talent that I want to showcase that actually requires a certain type of talent token to unlock, so I will be over there on my ice. I will be right back. Okay, here is my ice wizard. This is my pet named Kobe. Now let me show you the talent that I can't even unlock. Uh, pets. Frost, frostbite trained. Why can't I unlock this, you may ask? Let me show you. This requires 60 talent tokens that you can easily get. This, the elemental tokens are kind of easy to get. The ice talent tokens, you might need to get lucky. And this is the main problem. The frostbite token. I don't know where to get this. 
I think it was actually available in a battle pass recently, but it's no longer there, so that's kind of an issue. Now, let me showcase how to use these pet talents. So I will go back on my, I think I'll go on my fire again, and I will showcase how to use these. So I will be right back. Okay, here we are on Unicorn Way, back on my fire. I am going to showcase Leaf Storm Trained, which is on my pet, Dr. Midnight. He has, of course, Leaf Storm Trained. Now, first, he has to get into battle. Oh, I should mention you can use this in Decathlon, so this is great pet for Decathlon that is Death. <laughs> death Decathlon, I mean to say. Now, you see, this certain will cast will cast in three rounds, so I'm going to pass a few turns. Now, I'll pass again. And I'll pass one more time. Now it's available to cast. But here's the most important part. Not only does this cost happen if you don't... This casts after a regular spell. So if I cast Meteor... Or let's say if I cast... If I click on this, which you have to use. This isn't a hit all spell. So it'll help everybody. If you click on Meteor, this will activate first. Now, I don't want to show... I don't want to do that. So I will guess I'll pass. I'll click on this and I'll click pass. There he goes. Uh, that's how the talent token, that's how it works. Okay, another thing I want to cover. There are some pet talents that will open up chests, like uh, the one I'm about to show you. It's called Mythfinder. I made a video on this a long time ago, so go check that video out. And also my pet talent showcase series. I make a lot of videos on that series. Now, what you'll do is you need to find a wooden chest. And you click this button right here and the pet will activate. But the thing is, this doesn't work either, and it takes a while for it to activate again. So I wouldn't recommend getting these taunts, at least in, until they work, because the, I, I don't have any luck with this. The same thing happened with the element to retrieve a pet talent, which also opened up the chest. It did not work at all. Now, one more thing I want to cover before we wrap things up. The school will casts. Now, these you get instantly when you start up a game or a new character and you go help Penny in that tower in Old Town. You train that up to teen or it'll be teen after the quest and it'll get that talent. It doesn't require any talent tokens to use so you're pretty much good on that. It requires five happiness to activate so that's pretty much it guys. Uh, thank you guys for watching the tutorial. I may make more in the future. Let me know if, if you want a certain subject to be talked about. I will see you guys in a video in the next video. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new, leave a comment, turn on notifications. If you have any questions about this topic, I will answer them in the comments below. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!